Never settle for anything less than your goal. Never negotiate below your potential. Never quit no matter how tough the going gets. You are entitled to nothing unless you fight for it. Once you set a goal, follow it through to its logical conclusion. Nothing is so fatal to character than unfinished projects. Too many gifted people achieve too little because of quitting. Quitting once is far too many. Quitting once will condition you to always quit. On 23rd February 2018, I summited Mount Kenya, Lenana Peak, 4,985 meters for my very first time. On my way down, together with my fellow hikers, I set a higher goal, Mount Kilimanjaro, 5,895 meters. I prepared for this daunting challenge in every possible way, including 20 pre-hikes four months before our ultimate challenge. Together with my mercy, I hiked Mount Logonot nine times, Elephant Hills five times, Kilimabogo four times, Satima once, and Mount Kenya once. On Friday 15th February 2019, we set out for Mount Kilimanjaro and we trek from Maragu Gate for eight kilometers to Madara Hut. Day two, we trek for 11 kilometers to Horobo Hut. Day three, we trek for nine kilometers to Kibo Hut. We rested for six hours. The temperature and oxygen levels were low. We struggled to breathe. We hadn't acclimatized. At exactly 11 p.m. on Sunday, 17 February 2019, we began the summit attempt. We trekked through the night. Around 4.30 a.m. on Monday, 18 February, at an altitude approximately 5,500 meters, I couldn't hike any further. I suffered severe altitude sickness. I couldn't breathe normally. Many brave people have succumbed to altitude sickness on Mount Kilimanjaro. My will to summit was much stronger than my weak physical reality. But I knew any further pressure on my body may end up fatal. The only solution to altitude sickness is walking down to lower altitudes. As a team leader, my situation demotivated the entire crew. Only four out of the entire crew of 11 made it to Uhuru Peak. While my mercy had the strength to continue, she stood with me and sacrificed her personal ambition for our common good. She knew now she was in a life-saving mission. And together with my guide, they slowly walked me down for five hours through the freezing cold to Kibo Hut. As I recuperated at Kibo Hut, I decided I had unfinished business with Mount Kilimanjaro. And Masi and I agreed to go back in four weeks and do justice to this challenging adventure. As part of our preps, we hiked Elephant Hills again and Mount Kenya all the way to Lenana Peak. On 31st March 2019, we dared Mount Kilimanjaro again. Two days later, on April 1st, 2019, my mercy and I refused to be fooled by Mount Kilimanjaro. We summited all the way to Uhuru Peak the highest freestanding mountain in the world. I dare you today, refuse to live a life with incomplete projects. When life gets too hard, live to fight another day. Make an appointment with success. Resolve your not the giving up type. Make a covenant with yourself that you will not die with unfinished projects in your bucket list. Refuse to die with desires trapped within you. Always keep your eye on the finishing line. And remember, you can't shape the future. You shape today 
and today shapes your future.